Hello friends, uh, in this video, I am going to show you how to find the cube root of a number. Okay, to find the cube root of a number, we have to know the cubes of 1 to 9. Okay, so it is 1 cube is 1, 2 cube is equal to 8, 3 cube 27, 4 cube is equal to 64 5 cube is equal to 125 6 cube equal to 216 7 cube is equal to 343 8 cube equal to 516 9 cube is equal to 729 okay so consider one number 1, 2, 1, 6, 7 and we have to find the cube root of this number. Okay. So, to find this, the cube root of a given number, we divide the given number into a number of parts starting from the rightmost digit. Okay. So, each part contains three digits. That is 1, 6, 7 is one part and 2 1 the remaining digits are 1 part so that is 12 is 1 part ok what is step 1 we have to divide the given number into a parts starting from rightmost digit and each part contains 3 digits ok so this one contains 3 digits this is the first part and this is the second part so remaining digits are second parts <coughs> so that is the first step now second step is consider the rightmost part that is 167 okay and from that you take the rightmost digit so that is 7 okay that is 7 so now we see so in this the 3 cube is ending with 27 uh, that is 3 cube value is 27 and it is ending with 7 so that's why for the the corresponding cube root value of this one we consider this one as a 3 okay corresponding this we take corresponding this part we take 3 and next one is 12 so now we will see what cube maximum value what the cube of these values which one we can subtract from this 12 so that is maximum value cube of 1 to 9 which we can subtract from 12 so that is 8 we can subtract 1 also we can subtract 8 also but we cannot subtract 27 okay we will get the negative value so so the maximum value we can subtract from 12 is 8 so the value or corresponding to this one we take as a 2 the second part so that is 23 so the cube root of 1 2 1 6 7 is 23 okay what are the steps involved there are three steps are involved first divide the given number into a parts Okay, starting from the rightmost, and each part contains three digits. So here, one six seven is one part, and remaining this is a one part. Okay, now take the rightmost part, that is one six seven. Okay, so this rightmost part, rightmost digit, we have to take from the right part. Okay, so that is seven. So now we have to look into this numbers we have. You know wrote here so 3 cube is ending with 27 so the last is 27 so that's why i'm taking the 3 corresponding to this part okay now 12 so what maximum cube we can subtract from this 12 so that is 2 cube we can subtract from 12 so that is 2 3 okay so the cube root of 1 2 1 6 7 is 20 okay? let's see another example root of 3 2 8 and 5 0 9 okay cube root of 3 28 5 0 9 so what is the first step we have to divide the given number into parts starting from rightmost each part has 3 digits so that is 5 0 9 first part and 328 is the second part now we have to take the rightmost digit of a Second part. So, this is 9. So, now we 
see if cube is ending with 9. So that is 9 cube is ending with 9. So the corresponding value corresponding to this part is okay. now we take the 320 part. So in this case, what cube maximum cube value we can subtract from 328? So that is 3 is bigger than 328. So that means we can subtract. 206 from 328. So the corresponding value is 6. We take 6 here corresponding to this part. So the cube root of 329 is 6. Thank you for this video. Please subscribe to